I have a restaurant. I have a, I have a family restaurant in the short north area, uh, focusing on seafood, home food, southern comfort food. Uh, opening this business was critical to me because actually I wanted, in its decline, I wanted to be a part of it. I actually wanted, I saw something in it further down the road. It's still a great community. Jobs, I'm going to provide jobs. Uh, jobs for cookers, chefs, bussers, uh, uh, waiters, dishwashers. I have a lot of poor people in my area. I'm, I'm, I was one of them, so. Uh. So, I know that a lot of people in this community um, need to know uh, what, the, what the law is and what their rights are and try to figure out a way to help them with some of the issues that they have. So, I think Wyland Park is definitely someplace a viable place to have a law practice. Um, I think there are some um, capable people in this community that could definitely um, be a valuable asset to my practice. Uh, I think it's a um, great place um, to network. It's a great place to meet folks that uh, have talents that you don't necessarily know right away. Hiring someone from this community would be advantageous for me, but it would also be giving back to a community that I love and care for. You know, my barber is on the east side of Columbus. My accountant is in the university district. Uh, my doctor is on the west side of Columbus. So I'm consistently going outside of my community to get services that are essential to uh, my livelihood. And I know that a lot of people in this community probably do some of, some of those similar things. I work for Brothers Drake and um, we make mead, we make alcohol from honey, um, the world's oldest alcohol and we are moving our business to Wineland Park um, and we live in Wineland Park and we deeply believe in the importance of investing in our neighborhood and um, brewing locally and using local ingredients and selling locally and we want to move our business to Wineland Park to be more of a part of the community and be a space where people can come together and can share a drink. One of the reasons we'd like to move to Wineland Park is that we're really cramped up in the north side and we're also very difficult to find. So we'd like to take advantage of Wineland Park's excellent location, uh, access to the short north, um, as well as have uh, gain more square footage in which we can host more events and um, make more um, space available to people to do tastings, educational classes, um, meeting spaces, um, and other events.
whatever it is that we can provide um, as a practicing attorney or as a law office, we want to be able to uh, instill other people and empower other people to join in with us. And I think that's really critical and really key. Folks need so much job training and really need development. And I think it's important for our community to, to grow uh, is that we're investing back in folks and investing in the human resources that we um, that we employ. I figured it would be a good finale to have a restaurant in a place like this where I can make a difference, where I can bring the place up, give give the the outside area thinks this is such a bad place, so I would like to let them know that it's changed. And there are good things in the short north area. Right here off OSU campus, we do have the short north isn't the same. It has changed. So pretty soon you will be able to cross Chittenden. And you will be able to cross Fifth Avenue from Italian Village and come in here without, you know, being afraid, without fearing your life or gang activity or this positive things.